Good morning everybody, what's up? It's Molly, welcome back to another vlog. If you're new here and do not know me, my name is Molly. I am a junior at the University of Alabama and I'm also a Pi Beta Phi here. And I could not be more excited to be bringing you guys along for my next two days in my life because I have a ton of really exciting stuff going on these next few days and the rest of this week. And I really just can't wait to share a little glimpse into what some of it is. Today is Monday, September 20th and as you guys know on Mondays and Wednesdays I only have one class at 3 30 which I'm definitely going to go to even though attendance isn't mandatory today um but another few things I'm doing today going to get my nails done this morning it is like almost 9 a.m right now um it opens at 10 so I have an appointment for right when it opens because this Friday is my best friend Lauren and I's um birthday 21st birthday sign night where you get a sign but it's a two and a one and it's kind of compromised of things that you love um, and like a close friend makes it for you and you just kind of celebrate your birthday. It's like a tradition down here that people do. Now we're back on track. It's just a little tradition that people here do for 21st. So that is this Friday for us and so I'm going to get my nails redone. It's been probably two and a half to three weeks. Um, so I'm going to do that this morning and then I actually had to put on more makeup than I typically do for a typical college day for me because I have to take my composite for Pi Phi at 12.20. It's a busy day, not really as much schoolwork. It'll be a really great day. I'm really excited to bring you guys along for everything. I'm already dressed, um, but I do want to get my makeup on and pack up my bag because if for some reason my nail appointment takes longer than I expect, I want to be able to just go straight to Pi Fi. We're gonna start doing makeup and then we're gonna get going to get our nails done. little interruption in my getting ready process it's resident appreciation week at my apartment complex and so they had like donuts and coffee this morning as you guys know i'm not a huge coffee drinker but i'm giving this one a shot because it's from a local coffee bar they got us like these cute little coffees and so i'm gonna give it a shot we're gonna drink it on the way to get my nails done but my makeup is done i really didn't do anything like full makeup like i literally did glossy concealer regular powder blush mascara bag is all packed up have my wallet and everything and then i also was just like wiping down and cleaning up a little bit before i head out let me show you what i'm wearing today this sweat short set is from ritzia it's a navy and then i just paired it with these golden gooses i don't know i just thought it was cute so that's the outfit for today um but i'm gonna head over there go to my car in a few minutes and then drink this coffee we're gonna give this a shot and enjoy a little bit of self-care to start the day. On the way to getting my nails done right now. I wanted to tell you guys a little bit about this weekend. Um, because At the light, turn left onto 10th Avenue. Because um, it was kind of crazy. We had an away game. We played Florida and we won, by the way. But it was crazy being here instead of going to the game because we had like this insane flooding that happened. Um, it was like in the span of an hour and a half we had four inches of rain come down and Tuscaloosa has notoriously bad like draining and sewer systems um and so like all of the neighborhoods got really flooded like my parking deck started to flood um like trucks were like pretty much submerged like like wheel like probably pretty much like from a, like a high standing truck like the door it was probably how high the water was and people were like kayaking and people were like trying to like push their cars out of the water like it was literally insane I can put pictures in here of some screenshots or pictures I took of it so it was really crazy and so for the game I didn't really do anything um, because I couldn't leave the house for like that time and the game started at 2 so like once the rain stopped raining at the level it was it was like too dangerous to drive because there was a bunch of water everywhere um but i just wanted to update you guys about the weekend and kind of what happened um but i'm really looking forward to this weekend having another home game and then we have a home game again next weekend um so we get a little bit of football back in tuscaloosa after a week off um 
but yeah i'll update you guys once i get to the nail salon probably and if not you'll see me with new nails <laughs> nails are done i'm literally obsessed with the color it's like a very like gray light blue i don't even know how to explain it. it's kind of hard to see it like i don't know if you can tell but i'm absolutely obsessed with how they turned out i am going to drive back to my apartment and then i'm going to head straight to pi fi it's 11 30 now so my composite is in 50 minutes we're looking a little rough, I'm not gonna lie. We're gonna drive back and we're gonna walk to Pi Pi and have lunch, do homework before my class and take this composite. We're in my bathroom and the reason we are in my bathroom right now is because they are doing, con do you hear that? But they're doing construction and hammering very loudly. It's very loud. So if you hear it, I'm just gonna talk over it because I it hasn't stopped all day according to Ava. So I'm just gonna do this. I got a glossy package in the mail. So I wanted to do a little haul and also they sent me something like full size completely for free, which really threw me off. So that was kind of cool. I'll save that for last though. I quite literally ran out of every glossy product I use at the same time. And so it's pretty, it's a bigger order than I typically do. Um, so Milky Jelly Cleanser, my go-to cleanser, got her in a full size, and then I got another one of the Soothing Face Mist, which is a rose water spray, and then I also got the Pro Tip Brush Point Liquid Eyeliner, but it just looks like that, because story time, I went to Ulta and got a Cap on D eyeliner, because that's what I normally use if I don't have a Glossier one, and I bought it and I used it once. It's like a faded black and I know for a fact I bought the right one. So it's just very weird. Um, so I got that eyeliner. Then I also got the Glossier Stretch Concealer. I get it in the shade G10, um, which I believe is called Light Medium. And I just like love the packaging. My other one is quite literally done. Glad I got another one of those because it's really good for like the everyday natural concealer. And then I also got the Glossier boy brow in the shade brown because i was quite literally using the remnants from my last one and i was just getting sad so got her again oh and if you didn't see my nails really well earlier i'm obsessed with them and so then the free thing which really threw me off because i just did not order this maybe it was a mistake i honestly don't know but they sent me a cloud paint which are their liquid blushes and it's in the shade storm which is like very red like very very red but i thought that was sweet and cool and fun so that's my mini glossy haul i will link everything in the description if you guys are interested in shopping any of these items it's definitely my go-to brand for the everyday natural makeup um i've been using their products a lot more especially like on days where i'm going to class and really just don't need much but just want to feel a little more awake by just doing the process of getting ready and putting on a little bit of makeup it is like 4 30 and dinner for um pi fi on chapter nights which is tonight starts at five it goes five to six and so i think i'm gonna walk over around 5 15. i'm not gonna bring any homework or anything over i kind of just want to sit talk to my friends enjoy a little bit of time and not doing anything that's kind of the plan for the rest of the night when i come back i'll probably do a little bit more homework um tomorrow i have two classes because i do have a test in psych so i only have my 9 30 and my 12 30 tomorrow um and then i'll be taking my test probably around two so just do a little bit more prep for that but besides that that's really all i have to do for the rest of the night which is really nice this week is definitely a lot more lenient in terms of my workload which is very very nice my mom is also coming into town tomorrow night um she has to do work in this area so we're grabbing dinner tomorrow um evening which i probably won't be vlogging because my little needs the camera for her last week of Big Little, I'm so excited to get that video up and published for you guys once it's done. Big Little Reveal is not this Friday, but the following Friday, and so it should be up shortly afterward. But that's my update. I'm gonna just get ready to go back to Pi Fi. Put my hair in a claw clip, probably change because I'm kind of sweaty. It's really hot outside out of nowhere. So we're gonna do all that and then go get some really yummy dinner at Pi Fi. Okay, I'm about to go back to Pi Fi. I changed clothes. Um, these sweats are from University Tees. This tank is urban. 
and then my brandy jacket and kept the same golden gooses on. I'm meeting Lauren to walk in like five minutes. Dinner is chicken parm and spaghetti, so it's gonna be really good. Our Italian food is always so, so yummy. So I'm gonna go chow down, eat some dinner, go to chapter, and then I'll be back here tonight doing some homework and just relaxing. Back from chapter, it's basically 7.30 p.m. I still have to shower and everything. I literally just walked in the door, but two exciting things happened at chapter tonight. First, we got a post-chapter treat from Insomnia Cookies. Um, so thank you, Pi Fi, for that, because I always love some Insomnia Cookies. But this was the really cool thing. Our whole chapter got sent these Tarte Maneater mascaras for Bama TikTok, which was really cool. Um, I've used this mascara in the past. I literally love it. So it's like so cool that like Bama Rush Talk literally got us like 400 bottles of mascara delivered to our door. Um, so that was really cool and really fun. And I wanted to share that with you guys. And you will see me in the morning for classes. Good morning, everybody. Kind of a change of plans of what I was typically expecting to do. It is actually 7.20 in the morning right now. I decided to go and take my psych test at PiFi before my first class instead of after my second one um, so I can come back here, relax, do a little bit of homework, and like chill um, before I have my capstone agency meetings tonight and then I'm getting dinner with my mom. So it just kind of works out a little bit better this way. I have a little bit more free time in the middle of the day, um, which I would honestly just prefer that. So we woke up earlier than we typically really ever do um, to go and take my psych test. Um, so that's kind of what is happening right now. I'm dressed. I also have to film something for Capstone Agency, like kind of as I'm going throughout my day because we're trying to work on our TikTok presence. So I have to start that TikTok before I leave. Um, but this is what I'm wearing today. It's really just a barstool sweatshirt. These biker shorts are Ritzia. And then I have a gray tank top on underneath this from Ritzia also. And my um, platform converse. I already have my bag all packed up and everything. Like I said, I'm going to Pi Fi. I might try to sneak in a little bit of breakfast from there. I did eat some waffles here, but if they have something good, I'll probably grab a plate of that as well. Um, so that's kind of what the day's looking like. My one, my 9:30 class. I'll go to lunch at Pi Fi, which is Taco Tuesday or something related to Mexican food on Tuesdays, and um, then I have my 12:30, and then I'll just head home. So. That's kind of the first half of the day, giving my little the camera sometimes afternoon, so that's what is going on right now. So yeah, I'm going to finish getting ready, and it's kind of like muggy and foggy outside, but then we're going to walk to Wi-Fi.